How to set up payments on Shopify. Easy tutorial for beginners. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm giving you a tutorial on how to set up payments on Shopify. So let's get started. First, what you guys need to do is you will open up your Shopify store and this is where you will get. You need your own store which is going to be myshopify.com and you will get right here on your Shopify admin. So if you're looking for a tutorial on how to set up your payment method for a new store that you have created on shopify or you are confused with the payment setup then this tutorial is for you guys and i'll show you how to do that very easily first of all once you get to the main admin right here you have to click on the settings option right here in settings we have a bunch of different options and the fifth option is going to be the payments right here you have to select payments and it will take you to the payment section on shopify on shopify we have three payment methods we have payment providers supported payment methods and manual payment methods so i'll show you one by one what it means and how you can connect different payment methods the payment methods of your choice on your shopify store so before i show you the payment providers or the supported payment method let's go ahead and check out the manual payment methods so if you're looking for a payment method outside the store what you can do is you can add some manual methods such as create custom payment method bank deposit money order or cash on delivery so if you want to add bank deposit then you're just going to click on bank deposit additional settings right here add the method and then we have payment instruction click on activate bank deposit and it will be activated then we have the cod which is the cash on delivery so what you can do is again add the additional details right here payment instruction click on activate cash on delivery and your cash on delivery manual payment method will be set up on shopify so this is the first way you can add payment methods moving on we have two ways we have a payment provider which is going to be a third party tool a platform with a lot of different payment methods involved such as skrill stripe ePay and others so i'll show you how to connect a payment provider and then we have the supported payment methods now if you're looking for let's say just to accept mastercard then you will add one single supported method which is actually approved by shopify from here so let's check out the supported payment method click on add payment method right here and then you will be able to search here I'm going to search for a MasterCard, a debit card payment that I want to accept on my Shopify store. So we have MasterCard right here. We can add as many payment methods as we want. Then we have Visa card. Then we have Visa card right here. I also want to accept Union Pay, American Express. So I have added the payment methods that I want to add. Now on Shopify, we get different providers uh, suggested to us that if you're looking for these payment methods, for example, a MasterCard, a Visa card, American Express and others, then you can use a tool which gives you all of these different options in one. So that actually saves our time and also allows us to manage our payment method better. So it is actually the third party tools and it is a payment provider that we can add. So we have Ocean Payment, we have Faster Pay, we have Payment Wall, Stripe, ePay. All of these are going to be the payment providers. But these are the payment methods that I want to add. Let's say I just want to add Master and Visa card. So what I can do is, or just like this one. So what I can do is I can just select it and then we can click on save and activate and it will be added right here on our Shopify. Now let's check out the providers from here. You have to click on choose a provider. It will show you different providers. You can customize your search with the payment methods. For example, I'm looking for a payment provider with a Visa and Apple Pay, American Express. So let's see what are the different payment methods that provide that. We have all of these. We have to check out. We have AirPay. Then we have uh, ePay, iCount, PaySafe, Pin Payments, Tap. So all of these. I'm going to scroll down to search for a payment method. You can search for a payment method that you already have. Let's say I have an account on Stripe and I'm actually looking to connect my Stripe to my Shopify. So here we have Stripe. I'm going to select this one. It allows me to accept Visa, Master, American Express and Apple Pay. So I'm going to select the Stripe right here. Once you click on Stripe, you will click on activate and you will be able to connect your Shopify with your Stripe. 
All right, you can see Shopify partners with Stripe for secure payments. So I just have to log into my Stripe account. This is my Stripe account right here that I have already created an account on. If you do not know how to create an account on Stripe, well, you can go to stripe.com and you have to go to slash login and enter email address, set up a password, click on continue, verify your email address, and you will get your own dashboard on Stripe. So here we have our Stripe. I have payment section right here. We have balances, customer, and I will be able to, of course, accept my payments, my digital payment, and I will be getting my own digital wallet. So in Stripe, I'm going to click on connect. That will allow me to connect different platforms to my Stripe. And right here on Stripe with my Shopify integrations, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to click on send text and verify my phone number to enter to my Stripe account. Once you are here, what you guys need to do is just click on connect and your Shopify will be connected to your Stripe. Keep in mind, you can not only connect Stripe, you can connect any method you want, any method that you have an account on. You have Klarna, you have Apple Pay, you can connect that to your Shopify really easily. All you need to do is you'll just go to the payment section right here. If it's a provider, just go to the payment providers and search for a provider that you have an account on, such as AirPay. Again, I'm telling you, you just have to select that and you will connect your account to your Shopify. It's really easy to set up payments on Shopify and accept your payments. We can also connect different crypto accepting uh, platforms and you can actually connect crypto methods as well. So let me actually show you if you want to accept crypto with your Shopify store. So I'm going to take you to the supported payment methods. It is verified by a Shopify. So I'm going to search for Dogecoins. I'm going to add Dogecoin right here, Bitcoin Cash, USDT, and it will be added and let's see if there is any providers we have coinbase commerce that provides us the crypto payments and now all i need to do is just create an account on coinbase commerce click on activate and i'll be able to set up crypto payment method on shopify so it's really easy we also have some of the test payment methods for our account which is going to be the payment capture right here click on manage and you will be able to set up different test payment methods for your store so this this is uh, right here the payment section for Shopify. We have payment providers, supported payment method, and manual payment methods that you can connect really easily with your account on Shopify to accept and receive payments and run a successful business online. So yeah guys, this brings us to the end of the video. I hope that I was a big help to you and now you know everything that you wanted to know. And don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if this tutorial was a big help to you. I tried to do everything about the topic and I hope that you understood everything and now you are good to go and don't forget to uh, share this video with your friends and family members so they can also get the information they want to also you can subscribe to the youtube channel the button will be given right down below go ahead and subscribe to the youtube channel also hit the notification bell so every time you get notified when we post a video so yeah also leave a comment down below what was your favorite part and what did you learn from this video or if you have any question